It was actually when I came to Paris and I saw the incredible uh, David paintings and I thought to myself, ah, that is what a painting should be like. Massive, fabulous, incredible, grand. I wanted to make a body of work that uh, would be sort of my exploration and my experimentation with empire style. Uh, I went to uh, the British Library and I saw these fabulous Tercier and Fontaine drawings. The show is called Of Beasts and Super Beasts, which is a book by Saki. And I love the way he played around with, with Edwardian society. And at the same time, there's that element of uh, joking with mortality and taking death in a very, very humorous way. And I think people take things way too seriously, forgetting that uh, uh, it's quite a privilege to be here. The whole show is a lot about metaphorical uh, uh, beasts uh, that, that we actually are, and it is, in a way, satire uh, about society. For beasts and super beasts, it was lovely um, to uh, uh, be able to paint uh, uh, and draw animals, and I, and I love drawing animals, and, and I thought that it would be really fabulous to have these uh, morphed creatures, and, and, and with a little bit of s &M, of course, where would we be without that? I think that uh, the work is using me for it to be made and in a way that I'm serving it and, and, and uh, uh, as opposed to, oh, you know, what am I going to paint today? It, it, it's, it's not like that at all. When I start something, I let the work decide where it wants to go. The drawing for the Napoleon Suite, it was actually uh, taken from Ange's Napoleon and it has uh, the head of a screaming baboon. It's a, a sort of a, a bizarre self-portrait because I live in this bubble. And uh, the suites actually present uh, uh, visual questions to the viewer. They're quite balanced, they're, they're confined, yet they're together, but they can't meet. There, there's that tension, that impossibility, which uh, I think is perhaps a reflection of our uh, uh, individual state. When I started, I could not afford uh, oil paints because uh, Michael Harding Cobalt Blue or Series 6, that big a tube is 60 pounds. That was my food money for two weeks. So I went to the local hardware shop on Shaftesbury Avenue and, and I got the cheapest uh, interior decorator paints. And I experimented seeing how uh, materials react with each other. And over years, it just became more and more resolved. It would be fair to say that uh, the show at the Ropa Gallery is 13 years of working and concentrating in a certain way. When you start off as an artist, when you're very, very insecure, you need to be inspired. Now, if my work ever can inspire people, I think uh, my job on earth is done. <laughs>